Nick Taylor is the older of the two. Their weights are Once similar again, ladies and gentlemen, 72. this is our middleweight super fight of the and evening. The it is scheduled for three three-minute rounds of kickboxing action. It has a 72 kg weight limit. Introducing be, first fighting out of no the blue question. corner. He hails Nick from Taylor Dunedin, will New have Zealand. Wait to come he represents down to that MTI kilo Wellington. Limit. He has 18 wins, five and losses, that is part of one the draw, game. with five big wins coming by way of KO. Introducing Nick Taylor! <laughs> and his opponent fighting out of the red corner. He hails from New Plymouth, New Zealand, representing Spartan kickboxing. He is an undefeated fighter with five wins, all coming by way of KO. Introducing Sean Ruthless Redgrave. It is now time for referee Clive Cowley's instructions. Okay guys, listen to me, I don't like your mans at all times, protect yourselves at all times. If you come together in the clinch, work your way out of it, okay? And there's no grappling in there, okay? Okay, step back, have a good fight. Yep, yep. Yep. Well, you can see the yep. size difference between the two. Sean Redgrave, though, is very powerfully built. Five wins, all by KO. Clearly, he knows how to hurt people. You ready? Nick Taylor ready? Stay there. has a remarkable 19 fight experience advantage and a 10 oh, centimeter oh. fight advantage. Big thigh kicks to start off. Big right hand left up to start off. Alright, let's go. Fight! Well, fight Cowley. He took control early. Red Grave can certainly punch. And Nick Taylor knows he now needs to keep his man on the outside. And there's a left hook counter. From the tall man, Red Grave. He'll be and looking go. very go. closely. Go. Go. And now Red Grave looking for the flying knee. Another left hook. Another right hand. Gosh, he's shown tremendous heart. Huge right hand. Start proceedings, then a right hand. And he is now claiming the spoils of victory. Short, ruthless, red grave. Well, he certainly has power and talent. But in the end, the height and experience advantage too much. A very, very tall fighter in Red Grave. He took a right hand and countered with a left hook of his own. And that left hook of his very nicely delivered. And this was a counter right hand here, right on the button. Boom. Beautiful overhand right. Well, Nick, I've got to say, uh, the whole idea of you guys fighting is that we've found our finalists and we need to give them time to rest. But uh, <laughs> you're not giving them much time. You're not doing your job very well or you're doing it too well. Yeah, well, um, oh, what can I say? It just goes the way it goes. I mean, I plan for a war and if it ends early, then it's just the luck of the draw, really. Yeah. Well, you caught one early and you came back from that. Uh, you barely look like you got a sweat up. Uh, you happy with that result or would you like to, to fight a little bit longer? Yeah, he came out aggressive. I expected him to come out aggressive. I've seen a little bit of footage on him. So once he got me with a few shots, that sort of made me kick into gear. And then I started finding my rhythm. So yeah, I caught him with a couple and then that was all there was. So with an effort like that, you probably don't get any time off for training because uh, you don't deserve any, <laughs> because uh, you, you hardly got a sweat up. Yeah, well, um, that's just the way it goes. Yeah, it was, it was my night tonight. And 
So I'm happy with the result, yeah. Well done, mate. A round of applause for Nick Taylor. Now, if you enjoyed that super fight, please stay tuned for after the break. We'll have the two heavyweights go at it in our next super bout.